We begin with a volleyball and a pair of undefeated teams squaring off today. An NLL versus track matchup. Springfield hosting at St. Ursula. First set, arrows looking for set point. Maggie Gable off the tape and Springfield looking for the return goes wide. Ursula takes that first set 25-19. In the second game, Springfield starts off strong. Back set to Gretchen Sigmund. Cross court kill giving the Blue Devils a two point advantage. But the arrows battle back. Off the serve, St. Ursula serving up a little blockeroni and cheese at the net as the arrows take the point and that set 25-16. They had the momentum going into third. Set over to Ellen Schott. She takes her shot as St. Ursula takes the third 25-22, sweeping the Blue Devils as the arrows aiming high in 2022. Um, I think we gelled really good and had some good chemistry. We have mainly the same team from last year, so we all have really good connections and relationships this year. I see my role just leading the back row and pretty much like the quarterback of the back row, leading my teammates back there and just running the defense. Yeah, we just work really hard in practice every day, focus in and just hope for the best. And this season, we really want to make it to states and go really far in the tournament. Brad Wozniki and Gretchen Brown are on the call and join us now. Welcome back out to Holland one final time. A track versus NLL matchup here tonight. Two teams not very familiar with one another when it comes to the regular season, but at the end of the night, big time matchup for both teams that can benefit them going forward. Benefit definitely. You learn a lot by playing teams that you're going to see in the postseason. Springfield coming into this match, coming off that win on Saturday over Finley. This is a team bringing back a lot of experience, just like the Arrows. But for Springfield going forward, what do you need to see more of? Well, the reason that you do this type of match is you've got young people filling positions that are, have been a void from, you know, from graduation. And so that's why you do this. And learning is going to be a fast learning curve. On the Arrows side, from start to finish, this team puts together a quality schedule, always getting them prepared for a run at the track title and a run in the postseason. We noted they have a lot of experience back, and it started with their defense. Well, they definitely they have great ball control, and their serve receive definitely is a positive for the Arrows moving forward. The St. Ursula Arrows out to a 2-0 start. Springfield will try and bounce back tomorrow right here on their home floor against Archibald.